Step 1. Make sure that you have clean hands, so either use soap or alcohol rub before you get any mask. Step 2. Make sure you have a mask. If you are feeling a little bit extra, you can take a colored mask, which I will do so today. Step 3. Make sure that the colored side is outside and the white side is facing you. So it's facing me right now. And make sure that the metal wire is on top and not below because the metal wire is gonna go on your nose. Step 4. Put the mask over your face and the ear loops over your ears. Step 5. Press down on the nose, uh, the sides of the nose bridge. Step 6. Press down here and pull it down. So when you press down, you don't actually pinch, you don't make a sort of a pointed tent on your nose because it's gonna create a gap here, right here in the middle. So what you do is you just press down so that you have a snug fit here. So that's the key, snug fit here, snug fit here, and snug fit here. So there's not much open space around. Some things to take note, never ever touch the mask, never ever do this when you already have the mask on. Why? Because you know you'd have people coughing, people sneezing um, around the area and the germs, the viruses are going to be on the mask itself. So what happens is, if you touch, if you touch it, the germs are going to be on your hands and when you touch your eyes, when you touch your body, it's, uh, it has a chance to go inside your body and infect you. So do not do that. Secondly, never ever do this. So I see a lot of people doing this because they want to breathe better. But if you do this, the virus can enter your nose and can infect you as well. Some people, when they talk to um, other people, they do this. So, you know, um, the, the germs and everything is just going to go on your neck when you touch it. It's just going to go inside your body. So the wearing the mask is not effective at all. And some people even do this. So that you know they can talk to other people. So same principle, it's gonna go on your hair, it's gonna go on your neck. Um, it just doesn't help at all. Now that you know how to put on the mask correctly, I'm gonna teach you how to take it out. So when you take it out, pull it out gently, like that, and then just throw it away directly. So what you do not want to do would be don't take it out and wiggle it around because the germs are gonna go all over the air you're gonna inhale it, breathe it in and you're gonna get infected as well. So never ever fold it in half and then throw it away also because you're gonna keep touching the outside surface. You also cannot save the same mask to be used the next day because you know there's already saliva and everything on the other side and there's germs on the outside. So. Um, do not try to save masks, you are just putting yourself and your family, your friends at risk for the infection. So I hope you guys learned how to properly put on the mask. I'm gonna have another video coming up soon um, where I'll be teaching you guys why there's a need to um, put this colored side outside and why the um, white side is inside. So, um, and also why you know you cannot do this because um, some just, just some um, basic science explanations about the virus as well. So um, that's about it. Thank you for watching this video and I hope you learned something from what the nurse says.